Flattened rice, commonly known as chura, is rice which is flattened into flat, light, dry flakes originating from the Indian subcontinent. These flakes of rice swell when added to liquid, whether hot or cold, as they absorb water, milk or any other liquids. The thickness of the flakes varies between almost translucently thin the more expensive varieties to nearly four times thinner than a normal rice grain. It is also called beaten rice. Not to be confused with poha, a central West Indian dish prepared using flattened rice as the key ingredient. In particular, indori poha is famous in indoor and eaten with jalebi. This easily digestible form of raw rice is very popular across India, Nepal and Bangladesh, and is normally used to prepare snacks or light and easy fast food in a variety of Indian cuisine styles, some even for long-term consumption of a week or more. It is known by a variety of names, avalaki, avalaki in Kannada, pawa, panva, pama in Gujarati, poya in Rajasthani, chuda in Odia, kuda adakulu in Telugu, adakulu aval in Tamil, aval and aval in Malayalam, ava chira in parts of Bihar and Jharkhand, chira in Bengali, simra and Assamese, chira, chira in Maithili, Nepali, Bhojpuri and Chhattisgarhi, poha or pawa in Hindi, baji in Nawari, pohe, pohe in Marathi, and fovu, fovum in Konkani. Poha can be eaten raw by immersing it in plain water or milk, with salt and sugar to taste, or lightly fried in oil with nuts, raisins, cardamoms, and other spices. The lightly fried variety is a standard breakfast in Malwa region surrounding Ujjain and Indoor of Madhya Pradesh. It can be reconstituted with hot water to make a porridge or paste, depending on the proportion of water added. In villages, particularly in Chhattisgarh, flattened rice is also eaten raw by mixing with jaggery. In Maharashtra, poha is cooked with lightly fried mustard seeds, turmeric, green chili, finely chopped onions, and most importantly with fried peanuts and then moistened poha is added to the spicy mix and steamed for a few minutes. Topic dishes made from beaten rice Aval nanashathu Ava nanakat also called aval kutharthathu Ava kudatat kerala, beaten rice is mixed with milk, sugar, ground coconut and banana pieces. Peanuts or cashews may be used. Aval Vilayashathu Ava Vilayaka Kerala, beaten fried in ghee and mixed with jaggery, dal, cashews, peanuts and ground coconut. Dahi Chira Nepali, beaten rice mixed with ripe banana, yogurt, and sugar. Although an anytime snack, it is also traditionally eaten by farmers during the rice plantation season in Nepal. Dao Bhaji Nuar, beaten rice is dry roasted in a pan, then mixed with yogurt and sugar. Chindayar pulao, a snack prepared by immersing the rice flakes in cold water, drying them, and then preparing pilaf style with nuts, raisins, black pepper, green chilies, and salt and sugar to taste. This is very popular as a breakfast or evening dish in families, and may not be available in any stores or restaurants. Chinde beja, flakes are immersed in a bowl of water and flavored with lime juice, salt, sugar, and black pepper. Chuda Kadali Chakata Kuda Kadali Kakata Odisha, washed beaten rice is mixed with milk, mashed ripe bananas, grated coconut, sugar or jaggery. A traditional breakfast meal eaten by Odias. Chuda Kadamba Kuda Kadamba Odisha, firstly after heating ghee in a pan, cashew, raisins are also fried with it. Beaten rice or chuda is grinded along with adding cardamom, sugar, grated coconut, ghee, cashew and slight milk. Small balls, ladu are made from the dough with ghee, after refrigerating it's consumed. Bajil ogarn or avalaki agrain avalaki agrain karnataka, beaten rice is seasoned with curry leaves, mustard seeds, gram, peanuts, oil, and red chilies. Optional add-ins like grated coconut, onion and coriander leaves are also permissible. Served hot. Goju avalaki or huli avalaki karnataka, beaten rice with curds, beaten rice is soaked in water and then sieved. Curd is added with table salt, and eaten with mango or lemon pickle. Kanda pohe, small pieces of boiled potato, onion, mustard seeds, turmeric and red chili are seasoned and mixed with soaked and sieved beaten rice, and served hot. Dadpi pohe, thin or medium-sized beaten rice is mixed with fresh coconut, grated green mangoes, chili powder, and coriander. Then it is seasoned with salt and a fried mixture of peanut oil, mustard seeds, turmeric, and finely chopped onions. Dahi chuda, beaten rice is cleaned with water to make it slightly soft, then yogurt and sugar is added. This way of eating flattened rice is popular in Assam, Bihar and Orissa, and it is eaten as the first meal during festival of Ma Bihu in Assam and Makar Sankranti. 
Egg pulao Nepali, spicy omelette preparation is whisked with raw and dry flattened rice and cooked in a pan in a similar way to an omelette. The almost cooked egg pulao is mashed and left to cook, covered, until it turns red in color. Poha jalebi, this is the most famous breakfast across the Malwa region of Madhya Pradesh especially in Sagar, Indore, Ujjain, Ratlam, Mansoor, Bhopal, Hoshangabad. Karbuyash pohe, beaten rice with muskmelon. Full egg chira Nepali, common in Kathmandu households, flattened rice is fried in oil in a deep pan and salt is added. When the flattened rice turns golden, red, an egg is poached on top of it and covered with the rice until it has cooked. Thik spicy fovu with coconut and hing konkani. This is the most delicious konkani recipe made with beaten rice fovu by adding a blended mixture of coconut flakes, hing asafetida, salt, green chilies and sugar to the softened fovu with 2 teaspoon of coconut oil. Flattened rice is made by Cambodians during Ak Am Bok around the 4th week of November and is eaten with bandana fruit. Topic in popular culture In the Marathi movie Sanai Chawad, there is a song about Kandi Pohe, also called Kandi Pohe. <laughs> <laughs> 